Hello everybody, it's Walt Winter doing a video, a uh, Silver Black League video. I'm going to have a bunch of these going up in the next couple of days, I think. Um, this is for week four. My opponent is Avery61, or as I like to call him, Mr. Undefeated. Um, so we're going to play my Dega Control, Red, White, Black Control deck. Um, lots of good effective creatures, all of them have under the battlefield effects. Uh, pretty decent removal package. Lingering Souls, which is a complete beast. And then my sideboard is kind of multi purposeful anti aggro, anti uh, hexproof, Tron, and then graveyard shenanigans, which I haven't really seen any of yet, but who knows with a format this big. So, um, but that's it. That's the intro. I will come back when we are uh, playing. So. Okay, here we go. Game one. And I lost the roll. Avery is deciding. Ah, one more land, and that would be a good auto keep, but it's too loose to keep that. So, pull again into a much. Oh, well, I want to call that a better hand, but the man is better, so. So, Avery's um, not playing shamans tonight. Okay. Please tell me that I'm facing like death and taxes or something like that. That would be hilarious. Probably not. I'm probably playing like um, white black or something like that. Oh, awesome. He clicked on the wrong deck. Okay. So he's not doing anything. That's going to let me go get all my lands. Interesting. Um, I did not expect this type of matchup against Mr. Undefeated. Okay. Excuse me. Okay. Four lands and no play. Well, let's get a little insight into what he's doing. With the Inquisition of Kazalak. So... Yeah? This is a banana's deck. Um, wow. Um, wow. Um, what do I get rid of? I'm not that worried about the sanctifiers. I think I just get rid of the stern cluckers. The stern clucker. Kind of has to go. There's his red. Second Inquisition off the top.
Ach. So this isn't going as fun and furious as I thought it would. Not too concerned about the burn because I'm holding six life here in my hand. So good removal sweet. tech there to keep me off of the life would have been to lightning bolt the deuter but that's okay um, so he's literally sitting there with two bolts in hand so I need to actually probably draw those out so I'm gonna go ahead and cast my shrink maw So his last card in hand is Lightning Vault right now. Still descending on Vault. Okay. A little lamb white, which is a little annoying. He's got a bolt in hand. And I don't want to play my trick mind uh, empty this time. So. Jeez, I'm crow. So he's got a bolt and an unknown card. Okay, one more land, and I'll be able to move the shrink maw into stall dead to bolt. Again, the tech play here would be to lightning bolt his kitchen finks but you meant okay because if he bolts the finks then he gets it back gains two more life and it doesn't get removed from the game um, but that's not the route he took and I'm still a little unsure he's still got the bolts in hand Two, three, four, seven. He's got a bolt and an unknown card. Now two unknown cards. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and write out an empty.
Excellent. I choose you, Pikachu. Okay. So that's what he was holding, because he was holding a lot of, um, like oblivion rings, that type of an effect. So, oh, I want the promo E Wilds. They're so pretty. They're so expensive for a two cent common. Okay. This red cap's gonna get murderous up in ya. I'm sorry if you can hear the bats up in the background. My runs, are, my rights run into bats. Um, it occurs to me that that might be loud enough that you guys can hear it. I kind of miss the 30-minute time limit or the hour time limit instead of 50 minutes. It feels not as... It makes the games feel a little more time crunchy. Not going to get a Magna Jet him out. Spend your good removal, son. Sorry, Avery. I'm kidding. Okay. Let's like top, bottom, bottom, top. And that's a helix. So that's going to get it happen. So I know he still has Bolt and Unknown in hand. Red caps are nice. I was thinking about running Necrotals, but I think the caps are just a little more effective. Kind of keep waiting for him to play a creature. I don't. I mean, you would think at some point he would do that thing that I just mentioned doing playing a creature, but he hasn't played a creature, which is confusing to me. See what you got. Thinks this is gain your two life, son, sir. Sorry, sorry, Mister Undefeated. Okay. So what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go one, two, three. Nope. Drop my shriek maw. Nuke his pink sickle. Let the pink sickle come back into play. 
So let's press execution. Remove that pink sickle. And then get in there for a million or four. Awesome. Bolt. He has been full of bolts today. Okay, so I'm holding nine points of damage and three life in hand, and then he's at 15. If I pop that, that takes him to 11, 9. When I get planes, okay. Scepter. Nothing I can really do about Scepter in my deck. I don't think I'm holding anything that can really get rid of Scepter. Okay, that's okay. He can helix me or one of my guys once. Actually, I'll probably I'll try to figure out if I can make it fizzle. My reward for being so managed for early game. Early, yeah, early game is this happening now, late game. He's targeting me, okay. Calciderm. Okay. Okay. Come on, gatekeeper. Come on. Oh, that is a chump blocker. I need one. I guess I have three chump blockers now. And suddenly I went from feeling pretty good about this game to feeling pretty junky with no artifact removal at all. Nobody's really running artifacts. That's what I get. Am I running artifact removal? Yeah, I'm running the wear and tears in the other version of the deck. Two, four, five. I can, okay, what I'm gonna do when he swings in, is I'm going to triple block. And then I'll zealous, zealous persecution. I know it's going to make him shoot that guy, but it really won't matter because that'll still die. Everything will die, though. Okay. 
scholar. I literally don't think I can come back from this. I think he's got me. In three turns, four turns. He's got me in four turns. And that's if he doesn't draw anything to extend the game. Yep. I can't mount enough of a offense to overcome him. So let's see, is there anything in here? Really what I need to do is I need to run fast and quick. Um, so the gatekeepers probably aren't fast. No, they're bodies. Man, those are worthless. Uh, this they I should have wear and tears in here apparently. Um, the timelies gave me life, but that despised me time and not enough time. I think I have to run it back. So okay. But I would expect nothing less from Mr. Undefeated than an epic, soul-crushing defeat. Okay, let's see if we can get a little more action early game. Oh, it's so good. I have to mulligan it though. That I have to keep. Yeah, I have to keep that. I can't keep pitching hands. I have to keep it. nice because V4 does keep the gameplay window the same size every time you boot it up. Um, so once you get your like video set, um, you don't have to worry about like reshaping it, resizing it. And I don't think I can beat them. <laughs> it's so disappointing to know that if he puts that effectively all of my creatures die to that and I don't really have another way to win besides creature damage. I mean, I have enough burn, but I mean, he's going to be able to counteract that. I think I'm just going to scoop and call it a night. I'm just going to scoop. I mean, there's no, truly no reason to keep playing because kills that whole entire package, kills that, kills that. Yeah. 
yeah. So, but yeah, I kind of didn't expect to win out against Avery. Um, but it was still fun. So, but yeah, that's it. Thank you guys for watching.